Wither Studios presents a game that I used to play. Hello everyone, my name is Boyland and welcome back to Mirror. Actually, I'm actually replaying the game because apparently you may notice my very old game plays to my very old laptop were pretty much not game. So, I decided, why not give it another try, maybe, maybe restart it, maybe just, you know, let's just replay it, you know, retry, uh, -huh. so, of course, we're gonna restart the game and all that stuff, because I was on a laggy laptop, and I did my best to, you know, play a game like this, so, let's begin. We are heading in to the... This is it. The place I saw in my dream. I know she wanted me to find this place, but why? Is that the... Who is that? Alright, so... As you may know, this guy is Will. He almost looks a lot like uh, Chuck Norris. He does. There's nothing. Back the way I came, and I can't leave before I get my answers. A drawer with an odd design on it. Looks like I can open it. It's a doorknob. So I got a doorknob, okay. Oh yeah, that door is locked, so... Go ahead and go in there. All right. Oh, what is this? What is this on the wall? Some kind of painted door? That looks like a Drake and Josh theory right here. Where Drake, you know, just draws draws on the door with magic marker while they're building their neighbor's treehouse. Who put this here? Oh, uh, what was that? The paint almost let, almost looks fresh. It does. Worship chamber. Will I can offer you power? A voice. I've heard this before. The shining. Trapezoid drink. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Where am I going? Oh, my head. Where am I? Difficult to see clearly without a light. Trapezoid drink. It feels strangely warm to touch it. Just gotta press Y. Okay. Alright, so I see how it is. This wasn't here before. Do I summon it magic powers? Where am I now? Everything keeps changing. I don't have a key. Yeah. Door is locked. Need to find a way to open it. Need to find a key or something. What the hell would makes a sound like that? Must hide. What is that thing? Pick up strange key. Got a 
that strange key has a gem embedded to into it. Wait a minute. Blues. Ooh, jur Ooh, journal. The truth. I may remember reading this, but I'm gonna reread it. The truth. I don't remember every writing. This is in my journal. Where the hell does did this come from? I always scoffed at those who said who would say that ignorance is bliss. That drive to learn the truth and do what I always felt was right is what pushed me through most of my life. But is the truth always worth seeking? Uh oh. This is not good. Okay, at least we exit it. Oh jeez. Whoa! Alright, let's use that key on this strange door. stares back what do I have if what do I have if to live for there is no escape that creature seems to be stuck best not to get too close what was that Yeah, best not to get close to that creature. Kinda looks like Siren Head. Not gonna lie. I am alive. Death has I am alive. No meaning. I'm still... I, I'm still has. I'm alive. God, why am I still alive? Sorry for the bad reading. On my... Oh my. Can you feel it, Will? The energy that pul pulsates from this wall bathes me in its power. That voice again. It feels almost painful to hear it. Oh my. The trapezoid's pulse can be used to reveal special glyphs that can cha charge it with energy. This is hell. Help. Hell, help. Hell, help. Hell, help. Hell, help. You die in your sleep. You die in real life. You die in your sleep. You die in real life. It says the same thing. Looks like a strange blade of some kind, but I can't reach between the, the bars. There must be another way. What does that say? You trust. Hold on, what does that say? Okay, move out the way. Can trust? I, can I trust my own eyes? That can't be. Ha this can't be happening. I need to remember. I don't want to die alone. What does that say? The words blurry. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to go in here? Oh. Oh, there we go. I had to activate that. This power is capable of more than you realize, but you must learn to, to harness it. Okay. Did I miss anything? Okay, let's go back. Those handprints? What is that? Oh, I gotta pick that up. Unearthly dagger. Has an odd design and a very sharp edge. 
Oh, very, very nice. Take that. Very rear, very rear language. Do I have to go meet up with the creature? Where is he? Time to face death, buddy. Bam. Got him. Is that a puzzle piece? Oh, we got a start of a nightmare. Very nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, what? Just a dream, huh? Even in my sleep, I can't escape this place. Oh, I got a meta metallic shard added to inventory. Okay. What is this one? Metallic shard. And a sorcerer shard that has an eerie blue flow. Strange shard. Alright, strange shard. When I woke up, I found the same object from my dream next to me. It looks to be some type of gem or shard or some kind. It seems like it is designed to go into some things, so maybe I can find a use for it. Alright, so we can talk about this one. The Trapezoidrin. The situation is absolute, but at least I have found something to help me. I know the name of it. it is the Shining Trapezoidrin. But I have no idea what it really is or how it operates. But it seems to react to my thoughts and can be used to let me see things. I couldn't otherwise. I don't know how how else to describe it. Not sure if I should be using it, but at this point, I could really care less. Besides, I get the feeling that it has taken a liking to me. Finding it almost felt like finding a lost kitten on the side of road except this kitten telepathically speaks to me while floating in the air. This place? I've only been here for a few hours at most, but it feels like I haven't slept or eaten in weeks. It seems like the more time that passes, the more my memories before I got here seem to be to become. I don't know. It seems like the more time that passes, the more my memories before I got here seem to to become. I don't know how to say it. Worry? It seems like this place has been messing with my mind as well as my percep perception. Here I am referring to this place as if it has a mind of its own. Maybe I have. I really have gone insane. First entry. So the big question is, of course, why am I even here? I've I've been looking for answers as to what happened to Daniela. To Danielle. Danielle? Sorry if I got it wrong. Which has proved to be near impossible. I've learned that I've have to accept all possibilities and I know it sounds crazy but there is something pulling the strings here. The closer I get to whatever it is, the more it seems to be noticing. I've seen things change right before my eyes, as if reality itself is fighting back. I've found a mansion that I've come to believe is somehow tied to that thing. I'll try to detail the events that I experience, not because I want or others to follow my footsteps or even to leave my, a record behind. I'm writing these words for myself, and that is it. If, if somebody else finds this journal, I ask that you destroy it and forget anything you may have read. Is 
the same thing. Go. Wait a minute, are these random doors? Doorways. Oh, now I'm getting a strange headache. Doorways. These dang doorways litter the halls of the mansion. At least one of these must be accessible, so I should keep an eye out for anything that sticks out. I also shouldn't forget to make good good use of the trapezoid journey. I don't have anything. Looks like somebody took took this door off of a cabin or something and stuck it in here. Is this there is no mansion locked no that I would I would not want to enter if it anyway the doors made of stitches I feel so tired I just want to get out of this place What is this? What? I'll look at that later. I really like the rain sound effects. They're really good. What is this? Who is it? And what is it? Needs to be locked. Trust. Safe room door unlocked. What is this? Look like the kind of door you would use for a child's room. Head downstairs. I've got a library right there. An door? Trust time and space, he said. Doesn't seem like it will open. Must be locked. What kind of door is this? Looks like something from out of an 80s sci fi movie. It does. What's this one? Oh, this seems to be locked. Yeah, it's supposed to be like a secret door. A handgun? Strange. That somebody would leave it here. Like, th this here. Looks like that somebody also left a note. Sir, note from Johnny. Sir Will, I took the liberty of retrieving your handgun for you. As you know, it won't be able to air air eradicate the most capable of werewolves. Where where but several does of lead should put them down for a time. If you find yourself under assault with only a bullet to spare, a well-timed shot as they are striking should provide a moment of reprieve. Also, my dear Will, if you want to keep your head affixed to your neck, then you must learn to keep Keep quiet and stick to the darkness. You may find the darkness at erotic eradicators, but it is only necessary to put out your light sources when they are within eyesight. Sound, however, has a way of penetrating doors and 
thin walls, so you must always be atten attentive of how much noise you are making. Of course, these places you will be visiting have a tendency to break the natural laws of the govern, the word of man. Just keep your wits about you and you should be fine. I have a, a few errands to take care of, so, but rest assured, I will be seeing you later. Sincerely, Johnny. A handgun is fine. How is that impossible? I, I can't use this. Hearing what yours is pathetic. It is a destructive tool. Take it. Stubbornness will only get me killed. I'll take it. Despise a dang and tonagonzing, gonzing crystal telling me what to do. I haven't held one in quite some time. I should be reformalized myself with it. No ammo figures. Oh, I don't have a key. Round and round and round and round and round. Is this a dark area? Oh. Um, okay. Looks like a door that leads onto a ground level hall. What is this one? Simple door. Doesn't seem out of place unlike the others. Yeah. It does it. Okay, we should go to that safety room. What is this? Who, who are you? I'm now, Will. You know the rules. I do. I do. I know you? Uh, of course you know me, my fine friend. As I can tell you more about your situation, but first you must do something for me. How about you just tell me what is going on here? This is my my home, and in my home you follow my rules. When talking to me, you must be seated in the chair in front of me. Treat me like a game, if it helps you to understand. So please sit. Alright, but you better answer my questions afterwards. Oh, we get to talk, save, error, or get up. We're gonna save, and we're gonna talk to him. Wait a minute, look at his name tag. No, that's, that's my profile name. Who are you, and how do you know me? I am he who sees through, which has been seen through by not so many. I am a, I am a lover of stories, and the fine of words smithery. I am your one and only true friend in this awful predicament you find it yourself in. Okay, I feel like you are messing with me, and I'm really not in the mood. Just tell me what, to do, what you know. Fine, fine. You can't just call me the Sav ah, safe room guy. Yeah, call me that. Well, well, I can offer you help, but you will have to find most answers yourself. I'm going to give you a key that goes to a door in the mansion. You need to go through that door where you where you will find a soul trapped inside. Must either destroy it, destroy this soul, or free it. Save or destroy a soul? This really is just a game to you, isn't it? Ha! Huh. Well, an, an, an eternity of reading does get rather dull. Regardless of how you feel about what I say, you have no other choice. <laughs> this is ridiculous, but I'll humor you, safe room guy. So you are telling me what the truth. How do I free or destroy a soul? To save, you must seek out something important to the soul that reminds them of their humanity. 
or to the story, and you must force them to repeat their death. Repeat their death? Are you asking me to be a murderer? Each soul committed atrocities before they died, so maybe feeling sorry for them is optional? Regardless, you will need to do some investigation to figure out how to do either. No, you, no need to fret about that part. We both know that investigation comes naturally to you. But why is that? I have to do any of this because you said so. Your questions will probably be answered in time, probably. So here, take the key so I can get back to whatever it is I do. Get up. Fine, give you the dang key. I hope, hopefully I'll wake up soon so this can all be over with. Don't treat like this like a dream, will it? If you do, it may be the last one you you have ever have. This is not, that was not a threat. Just a warning. The door that he unlocks is white and down some stairs, I think. Anywho, if you need if you need help, you can always come back and see me again. Save. So, what is this place? What do you mean by this place? Well, let's start with this room. Is this some sort of library? You see books, and assure that it, it is a library. Do you, do you assume that a place is a restaurant just because you see food in it? I really don't know how to talk to you. This is my home. It contains all I know and probably will ever know. I would ask you more but about yourself, but I'm not so sure I would really I would get a real answer. Come now, Will. Without me, around you would surely go insane. Each moment that passes is as brief as it is mysterious mysterious to me as I may I am to myself. You don't even know who you are. Well, I wouldn't say, I don't know who I am. I am of course myself. The only thing a person can surely be sure of is that they exist. I would however say that I find myself to be a mystery. I learn about me all the time. Can't we all say the same however? I suppose so. Do you know anything about the this crystal, the Shining Trapezoidron? I have read about it and heard a few things about a uh, few things, but I don't know much. Has it spoken to you? Yeah, it has. It also reacts to my thoughts like it is reading my mind. I really don't know what what to make of it. If it has spoken to you, then it has become bound of your bot to your body. Have you noticed how you tire easier when you are using it? The reason for that is because it uses your own strength to maintain its physical form. Jesus, this thing sounds like some kind of a parasite. <laughs> I think you have a bigger problems than a powerful scientist sentient sentient crystal taking a liking to you. I've never heard of it ever killing its own host, so just enjoy it while you got it. Gee, thanks for putting my worrying at ease. I have a question for you, Will. Okay, we'll ask it. What do you want? What do I want? Isn't that obvious? I, I just want out of this place. You only want to escape. Are you not curious about you are here? Why you are here? Do you know why I'm here? I unfortunately can't answer that. I ask. I ask out of cu curiosity. Of course. I want to know why. Why am I here? And where here even is? I haven't been here. 
long, but I already fell, feel so worn out. How do you know you haven't been here long? What kind of question is that? The details are foggy, but I remember everything since I got here. I see. I got, I guess that was a good enough answer to my question. I'm busy sitting here doing nothing, Well, Come by later. Alright. Let's figure out this, uh, that puzzle piece I still have in my hand. Yeah, we gotta go back. Does this even unlock new power? Oh, trusty. Gee, nothing special about it, but the Satan guy seems to think I could find a use for it. Let's see if this will probably put this on. Oh my. Oh my. Pretty good effects right there. Oh jeez. That scream. That was this has to be it. Ah, my eyes are starting to burn. I feel strange, almost like I'm weightless. This place looks so familiar. What do you think? D Danielle? Daniela? Your mind slipped away for a minute, moment. I need that, so don't go losing it. I'm fine, thanks for asking. It seems that vision wasn't real. Did placing that shard trigger it? Jesus. Oops. Uh, let's go back. What, what kind of door is this? The air around it smells horrible. Yeah, the air kind of does smell horrible. Alright, let's look at some notes. Shall we? Note from Johnny. Oh, right, right, right. I, yeah, I read this. Key. Key. The safe room guy gave me a key to hold to, and told me to use it. A door in the hallway. It seems I have a little choice in matter. In the matter, and regardless, I feel like the following. What has he tells me? What will I lead me to? Either answer, answers, or a way out of this hell. And journal. Masked man. I met a man, woman. He called himself the safe room guy. He wore a mask. Which, now that I'm thinking about it, it is not easy to describe. I guess you could describe it as being cosmic. He was sitting in a chair the whole time we talked, but if he were stand to up, he would easy, easily tower over me. The man seemed to enjoy messing with me, and I really can't tell if he if he actually knows what is going on or if he is just talking out of his regardless he doesn't seem to want to harm me although what he says doesn't always make sense i think i should be able to trust him i just hope i don't end up re regretting ever doing so Alright, we need to go back to the safe room guy and we'll have to save my progress. Do you have more? Well, I don't have anything else to talk about at the moment. Okay. Okay. We will go in that, that random white door in the next video real soon. So thank you all for watching this video. Uh, if you want more, if you want more in your 
I will do more of this later. So, uh, yeah. Don't forget to give this video a like if you like it. Uh, feel free to dislike it if you don't like it. Give us a comment, share it with your friends, and subscribe. Hopefully we can make it to 2k subscribers real soon. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.